Yo, what's going on, Sexy Samlander Squad? I just played an absolutely insane game um, with this character. I'm not going to say the name because I might lose and that would be super awkward. Um, that's an RTO. Um, or I might get demonetized and that would be super awkward. That's what I meant to say. But anyways, um, no cool. I'm playing this character because she got mega buffed. Well, okay. Mega buffed might be a little bit much. Mega buff might be a little bit much. So this, this, and let's just go shell, I guess. Oh shit. What's up, gamer man? Um, but basically, let me go ahead and pause. Let me tab over to Smite Patch Notes. I know you guys can't see it yet, but I will pull it up once it's done. Don't want you to see my Google searches. And I want to man. I'm just kidding. Um, monitor. So all the way down to right here her slow got increased from 20 percent to 30 percent scaling of course and her shield went from 230 at max to 270 at max early game it's still kind of the same it's 50 to 95 though uh 50 to 105 but tier 3 is when it gets the biggest jump i think which is 20 i mean i know like these other jumps are literally speaking bigger, like 185 to 215 or 230 to 270, but when you get your your thing to tier 3, that's really when you start feeling the uh, the increased shield. Hell yeah, man. Let's make it a good game. Um, but yeah, when you get your, your shield to tier 3, that's really when you start to feel it. But I think more than anything else, the slow is the biggest aspect because you always combo... The silence w with her three, which is a slow as well. You always combo that with your two, so that you can hit your two and you know makes it much more securable because it's such a slow moving projectile. Nor if you throw it without getting that slow, you're kind of screwed. I mean, there's you just have no chance of actually hitting it most of the time. But um, regardless. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm pretty hyped about this. I'm pretty hyped about this change because, I mean, as you guys know, I used to play this character a lot. Um, I had this span of my videos, maybe like a span of like three weeks in my videos where she was pretty much the only character I played and everyone got mad at me. But can I have that? Hey, thanks. <laughs> All right, don't root me. Who do you think you are? You're not my dad. You just used all of your mana to poke me. Now you got no mana for the wave, bud. That is rough arena. Oh, he's got vamp shroud. I was wondering, I was like, how the hell is he getting so much mana back? The absolute demon. Oh, I dare you. I dare you. I dare you. You made a mistake, bud. You walked into the wrong house. You walked into the wrong house. He went back to the way of like, oh, shit. <laughs> like slow-mo when he's running for the explosion and his mouth goes, oh, shit. And it's just blowing up in the background. He gets tossed all the way to fucking Timbuktu. Anyways. I, uh, I recorded a game before this. It was against an on her. I gave the on her two kills early on. And uh, I was behind pretty much the whole game. And I came back to win it. But I uh, apparently fat fingered my recording. During the game. And uh, I ended my recording like four minutes into the into the game. Apparently. So. Rough. Could you potentially not try to fuck me in the ass? Damage, 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 damage. Stun! Oh, it hit him. Alright, he's got to run. I'm going to say no thanks to that. If only, dude. If only. Meow, 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 meow. Good clear, good clear. Auto that a couple times so my archers can clear it. Go over here. I think I'm a little scared. 
of an invade, because I have 300 HP. But I'm also way too alpha to not take a red buff. But dude, yeah, last game was so sick, man. Last game was so sick. And also, um, I mentioned that I, 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 I'm feeling a lot more confident in my body, because I've, I've been losing weight. And um, I saw a couple comments on a couple videos asking about my diet, because I mentioned that I was on one. And that I, uh, you know, am actively trying to drop some LBs. And basically my diet, <clears throat> in the morning I have a perfect bar, if you don't know what a perfect bar is. It's basically, it's about 18 grams of sugar, 15 grams of protein, and it's about 300 calories. Um, they're so good. They're, they're delicious. And that's all of my sugar intake for the day, actually, is that, uh, that bar. <clears throat> um... But, yeah, so all of my sugar is right in the morning, and I think it's good for me because it helps me get a little bit more energy to uh, record. Hold on, sorry, I'm in the middle of a... Fisticuffs. Don't talk about me like that. And I'm with you! Wait, I could die here. Oh! 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 Oh my god, I silenced the second and I lived. Oh my god. My heart Perhaps she does. Anyways, so yeah, the morning is where I get all my sugar. It's from a protein bar that I have called the Perfect Bar. It's super delicious, and I recommend if you are a protein bar boy that you get it because they're so good. Um and then I have a protein shake. So basically my macros for the day are under 20 grams of sugar, um, carbs only for lunch and obviously breakfast so that my workout after lunch is good. And then um, yeah, about 1800 calories, about 160 grams of protein at the very tip top. I try to get 160. I normally, I'd say on average, I probably get more like 130, but it's still not bad, you know? Um, and I get, like, literally no trans fats. I, I don't really eat much fatty stuff with this diet. Fuck me up, fam. Uh, I really don't eat that much food in general, actually. But, yeah, so my calorie limit is 1,800. I just told you all of my macros, pretty much, and... For breakfast, I have the bar. Maybe I have coffee in the morning if I'm feeling extra sluggish, but I haven't had coffee for a while, actually. Um, it's normally just water in my protein bar. And then for my... I'm gonna go this. For my snack, it's normally a protein shake. For my lunch, it's uh, it's chicken and rice. Just I, I eat boneless, skinless chicken breast because it's the leanest chicken there is and Your middle I mean I, I know people make fun of me all the time but I literally I don't eat steak or anything I don't eat any kind of fatty meat I hate it I hate the way it feels in your mouth and the way it tastes Even and everything I just don't like it <laughs> but anyways so I eat chicken breast and rice and uh you know then I go do my workout and then dinner time is chicken breast and just an absolute metric fuck ton of broccoli but, I mean, I get about 1,800 calories a day. Honestly, I probably get more around 1,600 um, right now, which I, people say is too low, but I don't feel like it's too low, and I am uh, I, you know, I feel full throughout the day, so it's okay. But, yeah, I mean, that's my diet. And I, I think it's been working. I feel like I see a difference in my body, but maybe I'm just wrong. I could just be wrong, to be honest with you. Your team has destroyed a middle enemy tower. But yeah, I mean, that's it. And I haven't had a, an actual cheat day yet, mainly because I hate my body so much that I refuse to give it any, any more fat. 
which means I'm like basically canceling any cheat days that I that I have. Which normally my cheat days should be on Sunday, but I I just don't have them. <laughs> um, but I think it's a good thing because my craving, like I don't have that bad craving. The only craving that I really have that's fucking bad is a Baja Blast freeze from Taco Bell. That's the only thing I like really want. Oh, why'd you? Holy shit, he ran at me, bro. I was not expecting that. He's gonna stun me. And he's gonna kill me. Damn. Damn. Good damage, good damage. But yeah, that's pretty much the only, like, real craving I've had. But I feel like I've lost a bit of weight. Um, I haven't weighed myself yet because... I was extremely big. I was... I, I was really big. And I... Don't want to step on a scale until I feel confident that the number is back to something that I'm okay with. And it's still not there yet, so... I'm not stepping on the scale yet. That being said, though, I do feel like I've lost weight and I am starting to get a little bit more confidence back, so that's good. Damn. Welcome to death's doorstep. Oh, he got his divine, his divinity. The end comes swiftly and quickly. He does a lot of damage, bro. Like actually just an absolute fuck ton of damage. Rally to your queen. Well, that's not good. Oh! Oh my god, he sundered me! Oh my god, he sundered me! No chance you just sundered me, bro! <laughs> no chance you just sundered me! <laughs> my man's got sunder, holy shit, yes sir! He's got sunder, oh god! Oh god, I'm bringing it back. Oh my god. That's so funny, dude. <laughs> With the sunder. I mean, shit, my my shield is my shield is 270 once it caps up there. That's not a that's not a small amount of HP. That that could be a pretty good sunder if he does it right. That's so funny, dude. Oh my god. I haven't been sundered in duel in a while. That's so great. What's up, Gamer Nash? Holy frickin' damage, Batman. Go blink, baby. Go blink. Let's do this. That was a good blink. <clears throat> um, We definitely do not get Phoenix here because I don't do that much damage. But, I mean, I do a lot of damage to him, but not to objectives. <laughs> so I don't think that I get Phoenix here, but I will clear the wave and try my hardest to get Phoenix. It feels like I have gem when I'm like, wait, does he have boots? He does have boots. I think he needs some defense, dude. It's not bad if you build defense on your guardian, you know? Like, you're, you're the guardian. I'm the one that should not be building defense. Because it would be unfair. You can build defense, and I think you should build defense. Because things are not looking your way at the moment. And to be honest... It will bring good fortune. Be honest, I think you might need a little bit of help. I think you might need like a pestilence and a runic shield or something, you know, like just stack up some double defense and then you're unkillable. Especially because you got the life steal with the vamp shroud, you got the sunder for my three, you know, like everything's looking good. You just gotta get some defense online. 
no defense is too scary for you, man. Like, look, you can't be taking 1,500 damage for no reason. How much HP? 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 Then, oh, we shelled. It would have killed him through the shell. I think. How much damage does that do? That was like 500. Shit would kill him through the shell for real. How much does shell give you, actually? How much HP does shell give you? Um, 100 HP plus 12 per god level? What's 12 times 20? 240? Damn. It's only 340 HP. That's actually not that much. A weapon fit for only the Queen of Death herself. But you normally get it to block auto attacks, I guess. I mean, an extra 340 HP is not small. If I shelled and used my 3 and then he sundered me, he's looking at a winning fight right there. Uh oh. Oh my god. Dude, I I I am doing just an absolute metric fuck ton of damage. Like, I feel like I should not be doing this much. I mean, I'm not complaining because there's a lot of times where I feel like I should be doing more damage, and then I don't do that much damage, and then I feel really bad. Please don't stun me. Please don't stun me. Get out of here with your fucking sunder. Oh, the phoenix. Oh, oh, Jesus. A drink, perhaps. Your team has destroyed a Fuck! <laughs> I almost... I tried to blink off to kill him, dude. But my ult wasn't close enough, damn. <clears throat> Alright, that is a good game completed, though. GG Gamer Nation. Hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, peace.